everyone, this is Sunglass Rob from Sport RX, and I'm here with my good friend Nick from Oakley. Hi. We are on the About Time boat in Glorietta Bay in beautiful Coronado Island. What a day. It's beautiful out today. Yeah, it's a nice yeah. day. We're, we're calling this work. We're here to talk about the difference between the prism deep water lens and the prism shallow water lens. So right now I'm wearing the deep water lens and Nick is wearing the shallow, shallow water lens. Yeah. And there's a lot of differences and some similarities and I think the name implies a lot of difference. The deep water is made for deep water fishing and the shallow one is made for shallow water fishing. Pretty easy to figure that yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, that part's right. pretty easy. But like why, what's the differences? Right. Um, and really I think the main thing is on a, an open water, deep water, you more want a neutral, gray base lens where things are going to be um uh, you don't really need a lot of contrast boosting as far as the color of the lens right where when you're spot fishing when you're inshore when the, when the water is murky and mucky you need a lot more boost so what i'm wearing is more of a um gray base lens with this really cool cobalt blue mirror and nick's got on a brown base lens with a um, uh, green mirror. Green mirror right. So um, what does that brown lens kind of feel like, Nick? Uh, it really feels like um, like a brown lens on steroids is the yeah. best way to really describe it. Is It's really going to capture color, brighten everything up, bring full color spectrum out to you to help you see uh, fish better. It's a little bit of an intense color. It is. It's good. super intense. Yeah, you put it on and you're like, contrast, hello. Yeah, it's super amped yeah, up. It takes like a second to get used to it, but it definitely changes the color of the world. Maybe that's a good way to put it. That's a great it's way. It's not a neutral color where like the white boat doesn't look white anymore. It right. kind of has this amber hue. The intention is to bring color out yeah. to make everything pop a little more. And then on the, on the deep water lens, everything's still a, a, basically the color that it is. The polar, the prism lens has maybe a tiny hint of rose if you really think about it, yeah. but it's a very neutral, natural kind of soothing lens where that one is kind of like a bright yeah. lighting lens. And that rose base is just gonna help not wash color out like a traditional yeah. gray base yeah. would. It's just gonna help you see true color. I don't even know if most people would notice the rose. It's not even, no. yeah. Um, they're both polarized. They're both 100% UV and they both use prism. Prism is a newer way of making lenses where you can actually, um, I guess manipulate is a good word for it, the light spectrum. Right. Like, like play with the light spectrum where you're gonna let in the right color, uh, uh, the right amount of light in the light spectrum within a certain color spectrum for your environment. Right. So you're actually like doing something specific with those colors where on the deep water, you're filtering out blue light, hazy blue light, which is really important on out here. And then on the shallow water, um, you're boosting green and copper hues. And you're also trying to keep um, whites really bright so that you could spot the fish. Why don't we do a little bit of trade skis? Sure. Mine is yours, Rob. Uh, you know, we're, we are good friends. It is very different. I think it's, it's the first thing that I yeah. noticed. And this one is like, just it really, you could see that this is a high contrast lens, even though it's right. dark and it's a real sunglass and it's still a category three, like officially dark sunglass. It's just got this kind of like it brightness helps effect. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's it's aiding your vision a little more. And everything's the, a little deep amber, water is a little now. darker. Yeah. Right. And how does that one feel? It feels great. Soothing, yeah. nice calm lens. Yeah. Perfect for a day out in the bay. Um, another similarity with both of these is that they come in um, fishing specific frames like this uh, split shot frame, which we have a full review on, but it also, both of them come in a wide variety of frames, frames that you wouldn't automatically think are fishing frames, right. just because people really like these lenses aesthetically and functionally for off the boat. Like, right. Especially, I think that the, the deep one. Especially I, the deep one. I kind of yeah. just want it for everything. It's, it's a good everyday a, lens. Yeah. It's a beautiful lens. Speaking of customizing and really cool things, we are on Captain Clower's boat. We got to give him a big shout out. Big shout um, out. It's Captain Clower's dot Com, and he does fishing tours in San Diego. Half day, um, full day, and day and a half tours, uh, up to six people. Um, this is a really cool 35 foot bow. I'm pretty stoked on it. It's pretty uh, The bathroom works, I tested it. The bathroom yeah. works. Um, uh, and also he's got a really cool phone number, 619-800-FISH. We will have a link to his website down in the description. So uh, Captain, thanks again for an amazing day. Amazing day. Yeah, yeah. and um, yeah, what else? Like that like button, hit that like button. Hit it, tap Smash it. it. Mouse it. Is that, a, is that a phrase? It is now. Um, please subscribe to the channel. Uh, leave comments. Uh, any questions you have, please leave them down there. We will get back to you. All right, we'll see you guys out in the water.